Yo guys, what's up? We are here with some Series 6 VGC, finally. Been waiting for it for a while. I hated Series 5, not gonna lie, so I'm quite excited for this. I've uh, played a couple of games already earlier on, but I wasn't recording. Now I've got a chance to record and let's get a couple of games in. Before we do, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe. I am so close to 100 subs. I think, like, as of recording, I'm on 97, so just three more subs to 100. Come on, just click that button, you know? And let's get into some battles. Alright, so we've got another one. Dreladon, Weavile, Snorlax, Urshifu. Comfe Terrakion. Okay, so Weavile's obviously got the taunts, got the fake out. Terrakion. A problem for Charizard. Ah, I think I'm going to have to go Clops. Lift. But depends on what he leads. Could be beat up Terrakion. But he's going to want to taunt for sure if he's in front of um, Dust Clops. I think Whack Zard in the back. Yeah, I don't like the 9th of Charizard lead because Weavile and Terrakion are both faster, so they can just go beat up Rockfall or beat up Rock Slide and just destroy me. So I'm going to have to go Duskops, Jigglyph lead. Wander 36, Thrack on Urshifu. Water Urshifu. Interesting, I can't protect versus that, so I'm gonna have to max protect. Thrakion also gets Tomb. Choice banned. He's banded. He's banded. Yeah, Thrakion also gets Tomb. On a max guard, to be honest. Choice band, surgery strikes, it's gonna do so much damage. But if he taunts me, I think he will taunt me as well, to be honest. But I'm gonna have to make the play, I'm gonna have to go for it. Because there's no other better option. He's Dynamaxing the Urshifu, so he can even hit through my max guard. Oh dear. Oh, he's Dynamaxing Terrakion, okay. So, new taunt. Definitely new taunt. And no damage coming towards Gigalith's way. Alright, Gigalith, let's go! Yeah. Yeah, nice, okay. Okay, I'm happy with how that went. Sash broken on. Oh no, it's banded, remember? So I think Bulldoze. Knuckles neutral on Urshifu. Steel Spike, not very effective. Rockfall, not very effective. I'm gonna Knuckle. I'm gonna go for the Knuckle. Hopefully, I see a guard from. Oh, no guard from Terrakion. It's plus two Knuckle going into Urshifu. I don't think it kills, if I'm honest. Oh, it is weakness policy. I'm in trouble. I'm in real trouble. Oh, we didn't even pick up the kill on Urshifu, so yeah, we're dead. We lose. Bad 
banded surgeon strikes going into dust cops. Okay, there's a chance yet. There's a chance yet for sure. He was obviously covering the alley switch option. Basically, Glyph can take a plus two attack from Terrakion. Oh, he, he did that. He he predicted the alley switch and doubled into dust cops. That's crazy. That's actually crazy. Because now I don't need to. I can just nightshade the Urshifil. I can still spike the Terrakion. Whoa, that was crazy. He made the wrong prediction. Oh, he withdrew her, she feel. Cut there. So he can floor heal him. That's not cool. Oh, and he max guards. Good play. He doesn't need the healing now. He might be thinking at this point, does he have Alice Witch? You've seen Border, you've seen Trick Room, you've seen Nightshade. I might pop the uh, ally switch now. I feel like I have more chance of surviving a move Dynamax from a Dynamax Mon than non Dynamax from a non Dynamax Mon. So, like I said, I'm going to pop the ally switch now. Not really sure what Comfy does here. But who have I got on the back? Can I deal with Comfy? Should I be hitting Terrakion? Yeah. Did I press Ali switch? I can... Oh, I did, thank god. Hopefully he didn't press Ali switch as well. He didn't. Okay, this should, should knock out Terrakion. Let's go! Wow, mind games. I can't believe he doubled into Duskops. He threw a max knuckle at Duskops. What a madman. Oh, he's reversing the trick room. For Urshifu to come back in. Okay. But now, now he does have to worry about the, um... Switcheroo. Okay. He's still got another one in the back, isn't he? Urshifu, Tarakion, Comte, yeah. Can't protect in front of this thing. Yo, he has to predict the alley switch, at, like, at some point. It's a 50-50 here, you know? Like... <laughs> yeah, I'm just not gonna switch. He's gonna heal up, which is fine. But what did he predict to do? Did he go into Gigalith or did he go into Dust Clops? Who's he hitting? Who's he hitting? Please Clops. Yes! <laughs> Let's go! I'm not going to kill Urshifu here, so it's not even like... I've won. But... As long as I hit both my slides... No, Urshifu avoided it. Alright, kill this please. Nice, nice. We're still in a good position. I hope. Unless he's got something else that can bot for a shoot. Uh, okay. Maybe you can fake out. I, oh, I can't double protect. I can't double protect because of her she feel. Oh. I have to kind of just double into Urshifu, I feel. It doesn't matter, actually, because he fakes one out and kills the other. Can't even protect. Because he fakes one out and kills the other, for sure. That's how this goes down. I, I just lose a mon this turn and gain nothing this turn. Yeah, who you fake out? You fake out Charizard and you're killing Gigalith. So much damage. Oh, it's not even like I can win with Marowak. Because 
we thought we can have like Knight Slasher lash out. The other thing is, I have to hit this Poltergeist. Have to. You know, I don't even know if it kills as well, you know? Triple Axel. Oh, let's go! We're faster? Oh, wow. Lost the game. I don't think Triple Axel would have one shot that Charizard. Or even from what I was at like 90% of the time. Sash, we break the Sash. But we find out now for sure. Just go for the Axel again, it's Charizard, just so we know if I would have died to it or not. I ain't about to miss, so I'm going for Scorching Sands. Oh, he cancelled, he's mad about the Triple Axel. But hey ho. You get games like that, bruh. I do think we played well, though. Like, the, the, the Ally Switch mind games, we definitely won every mind game there. So, GG's, on to the next one. Alright, so we got another one. Durant. Durant and Teleon are just scary because I can't beat them. Let's get beat by a Durant then. Arcanine and Duraladon. Fine, I'm not too worried about this. I know you can max darkness. You can't stop the trick room now. Assault vest. Weakness policy Arcanine. Okay. So. And a knuckle rallied on. Put me back to neutral, and then I can bulldoze next turn to put me to plus two. I say that as if there's going to be a next turn. Heatwave. No Dynamax from Gigalith. Uh, I am Gigalith. From Duraladon. Slow Duraladon. What? That's a minus one. This isn't all that bad. Because I'd wager that Dralodon dies here. And so does Arcanine. Nice, nice. Yeah, heat wave, dear heat waves. Not a problem. I'm sure this kills. Neutral damage. Yep. Okay. So, we're 4 2 up. We've only got one turn after Dynamax. They haven't used our Dynamax. That's, that's interesting tech, though. Dragon Tail to finish off the, the trick room, to stop the trick room. Oh, here's the real threat. 
Oh, and here's the other real threat. Who did I bring in the back? Rotom. Okay. Yeah, so I lose. Ain't no doubt about it. Uh, let's go for stabs. Undurant. Is it gonna be Durant? Yeah, it's gotta be Durant. You don't want to be risking hustle misses, do you? But it's in a Pokeball. Could it be Inteleon? It is Inteleon. Does I just like just straight kill? No, because I got the sand up. I don't know. It'll kill Charizard for sure. And then an Iron Head. I just know. I should survive this, I think. Nice. Weakness policy. Iron Head. Rock Tomb. Missed. Let's go. Heat Wave. Goodbye, Durant. Ooh, plus two rock for going straight into uh, Inteleon now. That's why you should have Dynamaxed uh, Durant there, I think. Because you would have killed Charizard with a snipe shot, say. Ooh, let's go. Yeah, you would have killed Charizard with, with a snipe shot, and then Durant could have gone like Max Steel into Gigalith, which I'm not sure would have killed, but I definitely wouldn't be killing you. That's a, that's a clean 4 hour. Quite lucky, but hey, we take this, we take this. On to the next one. Alright, so we've got another one. We see yet another Comfey. Is that a pink urchin? Got potential double terrain setters there with Weezing and pink urchin. No rise in voltage users other than pink urchin. Pretty comfortable to go fire lead here. Marowak in the back. To Lightning Rod, Pink Urchin. And outside of that, I don't have any concerns for this team. I'm gonna get Galith because I got Heavy Slam for our Creamy and Comfy. Not entirely sure what this team does. Okay, so I'll creamy pink urchin. It's gonna be like decorate rise and voltage because I'm rather comfortable with switching Marowak in here. It's gonna be so funny. Alright, so Dynamax, Wildfire, that boy up. Marowak. Although we could actually switch him Weezing. That that would be clever. No switching, okay. So what he could have done was switch him Weezing to neutralizing gas, the lightning rod. So he would still hit Charizard with the rising voltage here. I think it matters. Alchemy? Not Pink Urchin. Pink Urchin, Dynamax, okay. Please go for Max Lightning, please. That should be so funny. I think you just die, Alchemy. And go for lightning, go on, go for lightning. Geyser? Huh? Can I just switch? My thoughts back in. No biggie. Life orb pink urchin. I hope he understands 
the Marowak situation. We're in his neutralizing gas, so he can just fire off a lightning. I might actually lose my Charizard here, but that wouldn't be massively a problem. No lightning rod. Clever. Just gonna mitigate that damage again. Oh, no ability! I completely forgot I messed up. Yikes. Toxic. Okay. So now lightning's coming right at Charizard. Fair play. Nine Tails is now completely useless. Honestly. Like, utterly and completely useless. Because I can't even change the weather. With Gigalith. Is going to destroy me. What's this water move? Why? You're joking. That was my only chance. Maybe not. Missing that boomerang was big. Okay, I can't believe I'm being done by a pink urchin. Burst it in you now, this shit. If I can bop. The Weezin, the sand will come back, my spec death will come back. So I might just die to a hydro pump. Well, no, I will die to a hydro pump in the rain. Toxic, what's the matter with you? I needed that to a little bit more. Gigalith's faster than Pinkurchin? Whoa, okay. Okay, so we're in a... better spot now, I think? Has he got one one left or two? I'm both toxic though, that's uh, certainly not good. And that's his last one. Okay, I feel I feel a lot better now. I can double pop this thing for sure. Jigga Drain. 
No sir, and just activate weakness policy. But Berry Berry. Well this is gonna do a lot of damage anyway. So then the plus two heavy slam will definitely pick up the kill. That berry it's even you now. And there we have it. That was a bit scary for a minute there, man. That pink urchin. So glad it was so, so slow. Like, Gigalith was faster than it, and I'm like an almost min speed Gigalith, so. Yeah. Anyway, GG's. Alright, I think I'm gonna call it a day there, guys. That's some pretty sick battles. Gigalith is a monster. Please leave a thumbs up, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.